Welcome to the Rain Sport. Thanks for watching. I'm Mariella. And I'm Jose. It's Monday, April 3rd. National Chocolate Moose Day, National Find a Rainbow Day, World Party Day, National IEP Writing Day, and National Film Score Day, which celebrates the amazing music written for movies. So here's a shout out to Hans Zimmer, Danny Elfman, Jerry Goldsmith, <laughs> James Horner, The Goat, Johnny Williams, and many, many others. Uh, Run, stop. Let's get to today's announcement. Welcome back, Ridgeview. We hope spring break was a nice time away for you. With only a little snow, but now we're here basically every day until Memorial Day. Here's a great third trimester. Today, today we're going to have an assembly during fourth and fifth period. You'll go with this class, fourth, and then stay for fifth. See you there. Huge congratulations to a couple of Raven Track athletes. The Summit Decathlon and Heptathlon was this weekend. The men's competition includes 10 events from track and field, and the women compete in seven. Athletes came from all over the state, and Ridgeview earned the crown. Jeremiah Schwartz and Kensley Galt both took top honors. Jeremiah beat a crowd of 25 to qualify for nationals, placing in the top three in half of the events and outright winning the disc and crushing the 400 where he beat his season record to win by almost four seconds. Kenzie was also super consistent, finishing in the top three in six out of seven events and outright winning the 100 hurdles. We're very impressed by these two and the others who competed. Zoe Nunez, who took fifth overall, and Hunter Trump and Jalen Tolliver, who also competed. Great job, Ravens. Woo! Softball played a in a couple of games over the break, beating both Sweet Home and Cascades in the Redmond invite. Softball is now 6-0 and oh to start the season, with three non-league games in the docket this week to wrap up their preseason play. Great job, Ravens. Baseball spent spring season, oh, spent spring break in Arizona at the Coach Bob in Invitational Tournament. They beat St. Helens again, and then also Littleton from Colorado and Mount Point from Arizona. The Ravens' only loss this season was by one run, 13-14 to Shadow Ridge from Arizona. The boys are 9-1 and one so far with non-league Canby and LaSalle this week before league play starts next week. Go Ravens! Are you a junior or senior interested in the engineering fields? There is a high school engineer career day coming up hosted by the Central Oregon Chapter of Professional Engineers of Oregon. It's on April 27th from 9.30 a.m. to 2 p.m. at the Ben Parks and Rec Admin Building. Lunch is provided for this free event, which has a great lineup of local engineers. You can see Ms. Mr. O'Neill or Kate in the CCC to get signed up. You must be interested in engineering and have your own transportation to attend. If that's you, get signed up today. Spots are limited. The Guitar Club will host next lunchtime open mic on Friday, April 21st. Come share your talents or just come and enjoy the show. Signups will start after spring break. CSCC's Career and Technical Education Preview Day is on Friday, April 7th. The Redmond campus has, technical, has several technical education programs, including manufacturing, welding, and automo automotive. Only 20 students can attend. Sign up on Canvas or in the College and Career Center. And that's our show for today. As always, check out our YouTube page at youtube.com forward slash Ridgeview Ravens. I'm Jose. And I'm Ariella. Have an epic day. Stay safe and stay classy. And stay snazzy.